Jump! Here goes! Fuck me! Hey, I was slain. That sucks. That's a really bad time to be slain, goddammit. I got shit to do! <laughs> go, my god, go! It's not the boss fight yet. Fuck. Thank you. Where's the nurse? Nurse! Heal my ass. Thank you very much. Dear Lord, get the fuck up! It's gonna be bad. Okay, made it. Still got all my buffs, right? Totally. Let's switch to Chlorophyte, and then Crystal, and Silver, and then that is the last resort. Nailed it. <laughs> totally nailed it. <laughs> Alright. This is probably gonna be pretty bad. I don't have a way to dodge his lasers right now. So this could potentially be very hazardous. Yeah, see? Those lasers hurt. Them lasers hurt a lot. It's pretty much, this is cheap. It's super cheap. But there's no guarantee that it's even gonna work all the way. Really, those laser attacks are the only things that are hitting me right now. That might change once his f uh, eyes are out. Whoops. Cheap, but yes. I didn't spend a lot of time to get the stuff that's required to do this, so... I think it ought to count. Okay, both the hands are out? That might be bad. If I could just beat him once, I would love to get the fucking Vortex armor. Probably save bullets a little bit. Because his eye isn't always open. Three hundred and thirty bullets. Ah, that was a lucky dodge. Okay. I don't know how much uh, health the eye actually has left. It has enough to kill me. That much is clear. I'm not beyond using cheap tactics at all. Okay, his eye's still intact.
trying to save on some of the chlorophyte bullets. Yeah, I'm down to a hundred. Maybe I could slow down like just a tad. Haven't taken out the eye yet. <laughs> That's how we'll know, basically, is if he hits me in the face. Oh, we're down to crystal bullets now. Oh, I mean, we're close. Now I'm gonna have to aim a little better. Or maybe. I don't know if this is doing anything. I can't tell. <laughs> Not really. I mean, he's not getting the health regen at the very least because I'm moving too fast for him. But there's no guarantee that, like, anything we do will ever hit him. I do want to work on a tactic to, like, legitimately fight him. And I know there are ways. I've seen it done. Head's almost done. All of the like random blocks that are in my uh, my thing are actually quite useful. Because it's blocking a lot of his more powerful attacks. I'm just kind of hoping that some of these are hitting. It's the best I could do right now. At the very least, the heat-seeking things are definitely hitting. So it's almost worth it to just keep firing these. Until I run out of bullets. Thank you for the follow! 
I fucked up my screen. Now I can't see my the the names that are popping up. But thank you. Oops! Shouldn't have used that health potion so soon. I guess I could use the- oh, that's a good idea. I could use the heat-seeking thing to find out, like, which- where he is. Because the heat-seeking thing at least will, like, go to where he is, usually. Unless some other small, tiny piece of shit gets in my way. <gasps> am I down to the heart? I think I am! Moon Lord kill hype! It's kiting. It's super kitey. <laughs> well, whatever. I think his heart pretty much stays in one place from here on out. I want to try to conserve on bullets. Because <laughs> I spent like an entire... two whole stacks of stuff. Ah! I barely heard him at all. The Meow Mirror is like perfect for fights like these because his, the way every. I don't know. The Meow Mirror was the first thing that I was able to solo kill him with. But you have to kill him first for that to be a possibility. Uh, the second part's not going very fast. And I'm down to my uh, base damage bullets. If I had made a few more stacks, I probably could have taken uh, a few more stacks of Chlorophyte. Definitely could have taken them out a lot faster. Now I'm just looking for anything that'll uh, heat seek. Which Scourge of Corruptor can, but it has to. Maybe I should just fire at the ground and then these things will hypothetically. Attack him. No, it's not really working. Let's just keep doing this, because these things heat seek at least. Gotta make sure I don't jump over my bumpers or into anything. I defeated a flying fish! This is going really slow. What else do I have? Let's see how the dead uh, the sphere staff does against him. Maybe it's uh I mean as long as he's he's not getting the health regen, so basically this part, because I don't have other bullets, it's gonna take a fucking long time. But it should take him out eventually. Emphasis on eventually. If I slow down just a tad to like, see now I'm at 69 miles an hour, which is about what you run the asphalt bridges at. So if I keep it at this, then it might help. Yeah, it's, uh, and at the very least I can see what I'm doing, kind of. I think you run the asphalt bridges at like 70 miles an hour. Okay, so it looks like he's mostly going below me, so I'm gonna try to fire like in a downward direction. Because the heart only stays in the center for a little bit, so. Try to get as many of the 
shitty bullets hitting him as possible. You can see he's down to about half health, so it's doing something. Yeah, it's going a lot faster now that I'm firing downwards. Because some of the bullets are actually hitting him. We're not just relying on the heat-seeking projectile. Especially when he teleports. Can't hit him when I'm over this bridge, though. Anyone getting annoyed by that bullet sound? <laughs> I am! Oh my god. Okay. Now I should be able to fire down again. Hit his heart a little more. As long as I slow it down. Yeah, he's almost dead. He's getting there. I want to do a legitimate fight eventually with, like, the same gear. I just, like, I rushed into the lunar event. So I, uh, I, I wasn't prepared. If I was going to do it legitimately, I would have the cosmic car key. If I was going to do it without kiting. Yeah, he's almost there. <laughs> it's... It, it is kind of silly that you could... I mean, this is technically legit. Because, I, I don't know. People people always talk about cheesing it and how it's real. It, it is cheap. Yes, it's cheap. But it's utilizing game mechanics. So I don't really know how to feel about it, usually. I'm like, yeah, it's cheap. But at the same time... Eh. <laughs> You're fig you figure out the game, like how something in the game works enough to where you can manipulate it. And I'm totally okay with that. <laughs> I don't know. I've used maybe like three healing potions this whole time, so yeah, this is overall a positive strategy. I can see if I'm hitting him because the damage per second thing will go up. And it seems to do it more right about here-ish. So. Did I just kill him? No. Almost! We're getting there. Why won't you... D oh, I killed him. <laughs> it's really uh, kind of disappointing because you don't even get to see the like the actual kill happen. <laughs> uh, I'm sorry. That was, that was cheap, but fucking did it. Yay! You got the prism, uh, the gravity globe. Fuck yeah. This is... This is